With this double stepped motive, our ancestors represented their vision of the cosmogony of the three worlds. What follows is an account of how, in the language of stone, we can trace human history from our origins to the present day. Stone. That most everlasting of all materials is the faithful witness to the research made by the Peruvian Alfredo Gamara, who after more than 60 years of study across 11 scientific disciplines interpreted the universal message of the cosmogony of the three worlds. The three-sided double-stepped motif was represented in ceramics, textiles, including woven feathers, with three windows in one building, or simply with three circles made in a single block of stone. The theory rejects the assumption that since the dawn of our existence to the present day, we have been located in the current orbit of 365 days. To the contrary, it has been interpreted on the archaeological level that calendars do exist, which record orbits which differed from our own indicating that in the past our planet was closer to the Sun. For example, in the time of Hanan Pacha or First World, this calendar was used. Recognized as the oldest in the world, it records an orbit of 225 days. In the case of Urun Pacha, or Second World, a calendar attributed to the Mayan culture and known as Tzolkin, was used which records an orbit of 260 days. Our present orbit of 365 days was expressed brilliantly by the sacred calendar of Hab which is also attributed to the Mayan culture. It is important to mention that investigations on the Hab calendar show that the calendar contains references to concepts of time of 365 days of 260 days and 225 days, which confirms the presumption of the three different worlds. These representations of terrestrial orbits of which the author says they are located in the biological zone found expression in the pyramids of ancient Egypt. This concept of three orbits of varying size with the Sun at their center was also expressed in the layout of Stonehenge. In the upper part of the pyramid of Borobudur, we again find this universal message of a central Sun surrounded by three concentric circles. The Muyok Marka, located in the highest section of the Saksai Huaman, represents the same concept of three orbits.
the ancient legend of Atlantis, as expressed by Plato, describes a capital city whose design was an expression of this universal consciousness. Haciendo un juicio de al artífice por sus obras, es decir, realizando un análisis de la judging the designer by his work de los diversos estilos en and que analyzing the technology used and the style employed de cómo están superpuestos los vestigios arqueológicos en el mundo. We reach important conclusions nos dará una información of universal significance de la historia humana.